Good morning guys, it's pretty early. Hubby's still in bed. So today's vlog's gonna be brought to you by Becky. But I don't know if you can see it, but we got some pretty good fog going on here today. So the highways are gonna be wonderful to drive. But I just want to say good morning. Everyone have a great day. Guys, they're calling for fog for most of the day, but when it when we get a lot of fog, I just love the way our trees look with the frost on them and everything. I just think they look so, so awesome because they're all white. They're not that yucky brown. Yeah. So, but I just, everything just gets a nice little frost on it. And I just, yeah, our horrible looking yard because of the dog and the kids. But I just think it's awesome looking. Let's go wake up the hubby. going across the lakes and you can't see the little towns because of the fogs and this fog has lifted some it was really bad yeah, this morning this morning i couldn't even see the guardrail you couldn't even see the guardrail this morning that's how bad it was but you can faintly see the, the two houses the, the few right here at the edge i couldn't even make those out i don't know if you can see them on the camera i'll tell you when we go past them yeah you can make them out there you go I couldn't even see them this morning. That's crazy. The trees look beautiful though today, don't they? With yeah, the I'll add a couple pictures. We'll add a couple pictures to the vlog today. That I sent to my Jeffrey. Yeah. Eagles, baby! Eagles! <laughs> I got... I went into work today and I walked in the office and I was told that the Eagle fan needs to leave the building. That's because we're in the middle of uh, <laughs> Minnesota Viking fan country here. Vikings and Packers. Yeah. That's not what I wanted to call them. I know. <laughs> but listen guys, I'm going to say the Eagles are going to win it this year and I'm going to tell you why. See, the Eagles are going to win it this year due to the fact that Vegas needs to make a lot of money and all the bookies need to make a lot of money. And the Mafia needs to make a lot of money. So what they're doing is everybody's going to bet on the New England to win. Because they've been there ten times and they've won it all these, like, six times I think they won it or something. I don't know. I have to look on my app. Yeah, my something app. like that. They yeah, won it, like, I think it, they've been there ten times. They won it five, lost four, I think, or something. But everybody's going to pick them to win. So then their people are going to pick, they're going to let the Eagles win. And it's gonna inter it's just gonna make all them people lose money. The only people gonna bet on the Eagles are the Philadelphia people, right? From Philadelphia. So that's just my theory. I, I we'll see how it plays off. What do you think? Coming from a daughter of a bookie. What do you think? <laughs> Coming from the daughter of a bookie and who is also the biggest New York Giants fan there was. Well what do you think? What do you think will happen? I uh, yeah, no. Yep. Makes sense, doesn't it? Yes it does. <laughs> All right, guys. I like that coming from the daughter of a bookie. What are you saying? My dad's freaking mob related? Oh, did I say that out loud? <laughs> we ain't even going to talk about it. <laughs> Don't make me call my uncle. Yeah, okay. <laughs> we ain't going to talk about it. All right, guys. Later. Video in my driving. Here's both of my hands. <laughs> yeah, this is light up some though, so it was worse this morning, Jeff. So. Alright, buddy. He thought he'd be funny and hide in the closet, and the closet has no door. What? Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> and it's just the bedroom door that's gonna be in our rat room, and it's like right there at the closet. It's not funny, it's scary as shit. Come on. <laughs> You know I have problems with close faces, hon. Come on. <laughs> Say hi to your fans. <laughs> Come on. Come <laughs> on. My arm's pinched up. I'm reading the light here. Come on. I'm close to 
It was funny. Guess what? <laughs> Give it a thumbs down if you don't think it was funny, and a fun thumbs up if you think it was funny. It was not funny. <laughs> it was. And we are only 50 subscribers away, guys. Yep. So, share, share. Come get off me now. That's all right. You can be locked in the house with the ghost. to be a cracker pot <laughs> and all I am is holding it with my hand <laughs> as you can see our outside view throughout the day really hasn't changed much still pretty foggy look at this then fog this is what the fog oh yeah well I guess I should do the tree in the front of the house oh. Oh, my finger got in the way. Sorry, guys. Look at that. And it's all frost from the fog. Wow. Look at that weeping wi that willow over there. And it's not even that cold. Uh, no, it's not. But it's just from the frog. The frog. <laughs> the fog. The fog. You got frogs on your mind. I wonder why. I don't know. No, nope, nothing's changed much. Still pretty foggy. Okay guys, if you look at the two discus here, the one in the front's the female, the one in the back's the male, and they're getting ready to breed. They've been cleaning up that cone over there. And uh, if we get eggs from these guys, maybe we'll do a discus giveaway, I don't know. I'm not sure, we'll see. But hey, just a reminder about our 500 subscriber giveaway. We're only 49 subscribers away, people. Yep, 49. So like, comment, and share the heck out of this video. Because the faster we get the 500, the faster somebody will win that beautiful snake. We'll start today's video off with our beautiful male hide. He's like, come here, let me eat you. Yeah, not quite. Let me eat you, come and on. And we're gonna squeeze right down to this beautiful female pastel het clown. What do you think? I think it's a snake. Nope, it's a ball python, sorry. Is it not a snake? Uh, ball pythons and and, and any snake that I kind of keep, like hognose, they're above the average normal snake. So. But is it a snake? <sighs> Does it fall under the category of snake? I'm a snake. Remember that video, guys? I'm a snake. I'm a snake. <sighs> and here's our beautiful Mojave male. Oh, but you know what's sad is Jeffrey just texted me and no one can hear her because we're vlogging off of my phone today. Oh, do 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 my name is Jeff. Does that he, make you feel better? He texted three times in a row, so you didn't do it right. My name is Jeff. My name is Jeff. My name is Jeff. There you go. <laughs> it's in the vlog, Jeffrey. You got it. Every day you make it. And here's our male head clown. What do you guys think of this guy? I think mm -hmm. he's hissing. I hear yeah. him. If he bit you, you wouldn't die. We would survive it. Bit me, no, bit you. I'd yeah. laugh if he bit you. Yeah, so would I. Everything else bites me. That'll be a throwback Thursday story, won't it? On... Oh, and it's not Thursday yet, so. No, we'll tell this. We'll do it this Thursday. We'll tell this Thursday of our throwback Thursday story. Let's get this big old. Here we go. 
the big old. Oh, there you are. Go ahead, tell Ooh. me. Look at how beautiful the belly is, hon. I know. Why is it so pitch black? Big. It's a anaconda or a conda hog, they call it. Yes, guys. When it comes to certain snakes, I'm still learning myself. So. Mildly venomous. Get the heck out of here. <laughs> you know, speaking, you, you and Jeffrey both. I'm. Hmm. What? What did we do? Yeah. What did you do? What? We have no You wonder why you got locked in a closet today. I didn't do nothing. Oh, you and Jeffrey didn't do nothing last night? What? You didn't make me mad last night. The pair is. How did we make you mad? Oh, okay. Were we talking about, uh... I'll check it in a second here. But, uh, did we not talk about, uh... We weren't talking about venomous stuff, were we? What were you talking about getting? Come on, show some more steaks. I don't think they just want to look at a um, black surface here. We, I was talking about um, getting a a caiman. Yeah, not happening. A dwarf caiman? Not happening. Um, whatever you say, honey bunny. Not happening. Here is the black magic male. Very beautiful animal. Yeah, and you just put all those wood shavings right in its I'll water bowl. I'll clean it all in a minute here. Look at the belly on that thing. Well, you this keep male, moving it up and down, up and oh, down. This male, I got plans for him to go with a bunch of female stuff I got coming. I got a female. Oh, guys, got to go check out the Lone Star Reptile video. Oh, whoa, my wait, gosh. Whoa, 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 whoa. You'll be surprised at what I got. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait a minute. Yeah? What do you mean you got more stuff a coming? Uh, that's called somebody's gonna pack some snakes up put them in a box and ship them to me Lone Star Reptiles You'll see it at the very end of his video Earl Jones has got the best stuff out Sorry, when were you gonna consult with me about this purchase? Hun, I love you. Can I make a purchase? I think you already did didn't you? Okay, then I'm sorry. I apologize. I should have cleared it with you first. Always clear with the wife first or you get yelled at, guys. Don't And you wonder why he gets locked in closets and locked in the basement. Don't, uh, don't follow what you see me do. Do what's best for you guys in your situations. And this, not saying that this was best to do it this way in my situation. It just <laughs> happened to slip my mind. And oh, I'm, so now I'm just a slip of the mind? So why am I still here? No, because I love you. And no, you're not. Obviously, you don't love me enough that you make purchases like this without consulting me first. You know, I'm going to tell you something. I really thought I cleared it with you first. It might have slipped my mind. Oh, and... just like you cleared the whole Cayman thing with me, too? I'm not getting a Cayman, though. But you keep saying you are. Not because Jeffrey is messing with you. Jeffrey thinks it's funny to see you get mad. Just like Jeffrey said, oh, I'm going to send you a Kaboon Viper one day. And we'll see what your wife says about that. Yeah, and you know what's going, what, ha what would happen with that, right? You go right back in a box and back to Jeffrey's house. And then what will you get served with the very next day? That's why I don't get venomous What animals. will you get served with the very next day? And I love you, Emily. No. What will you get served with the very next you day? You said you would divorce me if I got exactly. venomous. Exactly. That's. Do you see me having venomous? I don't reptiles? care if somebody else gives it to you as a gift. Divorce papers would be in hand. I wouldn't take it. I it wouldn't accept matter. it. It oh, doesn't so matter. Oh, so what you're saying is, if one of these subscribers say it'll be funny, let me send this venomous animal to him, see him get divorced, and I don't even know it's coming. No, you can't say that because I wouldn't do that. I yeah. would not do that. Yeah. No. Yeah. Mm-mm. Mm-hmm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm-hmm. Mm-mm. Mm-hmm. Nope. Yeah. Was it me? Uh-huh. Oh, shit. Where'd our cobra go? Yeah, uh-huh. <laughs> sure. Hey, you guys want to check out the Dubia roaches? No! <laughs>